Okay, so to create the header, what I'm first off going to do is go into my index.tsx file and just before the app, I'm just going to render a header component like so. So now I need to create the component. So in the components folder, create a new folder named header and in here create a new file named index.tsx and I'm going to use React Functional Snippet, so RFCE, and this will be named header like so. And then what I need to do is import that from the component slash header. So if I now save, we should now have at the top here a header component being rendered, which we are doing. So all it is is a case of adding some styles in. So if I create a folder named styles.ts and enter, Again, I'm just going to copy my styles across and paste them in. So I'm going to use the HTML tag of nav for the header as the container. This time we are also going to have a logo container, which is the small dog image that we are getting from this header here on the dog API. So the way to get that image is if you just right click and then copy the image address, which I already have anyway. So going back into the index.tsx, in my return block, I'm just going to return the JSX that I have already created like so. So I'm importing the container from the relevant styles file. So in the same directory, the logo container, which is a div and has an image contained within it. So the source is it's the same source that we've copied across. And then I'm just going to name this Imran's dog app like so. And then just finally, we're going to have a title on the right of it. So the container will have a display flex pointing into a row and then it will align items as centrally. So now if I save, we should now have the header component being rendered like we see on the app there. So I don't need to declare any types for this because we are not receiving any props within the header. It's just a simple component rendering some UI out.